Good morning, everyone. This is James once again from the Wall Street Minute. Uh, and I'm standing, of course, in front of the New York Stock Exchange. Uh, uh, oh. Last week, at the end of last week, uh, Apple announced some layoffs, and this is probably the first group of layoffs post-pandemic for Apple. Uh, it appears this comes after February's cancellation of autonomous, autonomous driving cars. Hmm. I've always been very skeptical about that technology. Uh, there's a lot of argument that it doesn't really work. Uh, and it's had a lot of trouble in California where they've been really pushing the rollout. Uh, and the Calif California state regulators have been criticizing uh, some of the safety data and the ability of autonomous cars to really function correctly. Anyway, Apple has canceled that program and redirected resources into AI. So, of course, they're... Uh, as we said, AI, Apple realizes, like I do, that AI is the next, next big thing. Not that they weren't working on it already. Um, so uh, I would say with this, this might be signaling the death of the autonomous uh, car. Uh, I know with, with Tesla now, uh, if you buy a car that sort of has some self-driving mode, uh, you need to sign off on it. There's almost like a class you have to take now to deal with it. So I think there's uh, the shortcomings of this technology are starting to become more readily recognized. Anyway, this is James once again from the Wall Street Minute, standing in front of the New York Stock Exchange. Uh, say hello, leave comments, and of course, subscribe to these videos.